Hello guys, welcome back, it's Illogical as always, and we're back playing some more Lords of the Falling. Now, I'm going to keep my promise here. Oh, that's not what I want to do. Okay, thank you, game. I don't know how I done that. Um, I'm going to go back and kill said um, tyrant that um, mugged me off at the very start. We're going to go back and we're going to kill him, as we are, because, um, quite frankly, fuck him. Get your ass down here. Just maul just... <laughs> Dude didn't even know what to do there. That's brilliant. Right, give me that. Oh, there's another one behind me, okay. Griffin, chess piece, ghost merge shard, okay, right. Dude, you're kinda glitched and that's annoying me. Just you barf on me, yeah. I don't care. Still gonna die a painful death, bitch. That, okay, hold in. Okay, so you hold circle to use your ability. Okay. I'll keep that in mind for the future. So I'll have. Um, on the other hand, though, um, yeah, I need to try and make my way backwards, which is going to be interesting. What do we pick up? The chess piece? Which is straight up better. So we're going to have to... And we're still medium rolling, so that's fucking fantastic. I love how the griffin is actually weaker. Like, it sometimes it is weird. Oh, wait there, that's why it's weaker, because we've got the boots upgraded, don't we? Right, anyway, I'm going backtrack. Or maybe not, I've gotten lost apparently, so I have. Chest is locked. Okay, so we need a key. Why is there so many locked chests? I swear to God. Fuck this tyrant. Oh wow, I've got good poison. Fuck you, tyrant. What'd you give me? Small Western anti chamber key. So. What? What does that do for me? I'm assuming it's opened up something. Let's find out. I don't think. What? So we, we, we went sort of like the west way, never he tried to And the only place I can think of is this lock. And so I don't know. I really, I, I'm assuming we're just going to run around and just apply a key to everywhere we can. Hear that? Aha! Finally, we found it! Some extra XP and a chest. What's in here? Cunning and an attribute chart. God damn it, I keep I need to stop doing that. Right, so um in terms of Yeah, see they're all great weapons which are not really what I want right now. I want a, just a smaller, lighter weapon, so we'll do that there needs to be removed and applied to the Griffin armor so it does. Um What was it we got there? Was it boots? Cunning, yes. Uh, improves resistance to physical attacks and is worn by members of the assassin. Uh, it's not really all that impressive for me right now. As it says, the main thing I'm looking for is a new weapon. So it is. As it says, that's what we are looking for right now is a weapon. As it says, there's still a lot of the places that are locked up. So again, that's also problematic. We're going to head back to the smith and we arrange our gear here a little bit so we are... Right. Talk to me, Smithy. To the room. Right. Uh, craft. Break down the small runes. Lesser magic. Lesser luck. Okay. Equip runes. Right. What have I got currently equipped here?
Uh, I think. Hang on. Oh wow, the one percent attribute scaling gives me seventy-eight. Over the attack bonus, which just gives me seventy-three. Oh wow. Right. Uh, let me just remove everything from here. Hang on. Ah, uh, immediately the gripping. Right. How do you just remove it? I'm assuming you can, like really can you just remove it? He. That's not very good, guys. I'm not gonna lie here. Um, it will. Oh no, it's press square. You have to press square to remove it. Okay. That there's. Of course, press square to remove. And then empty sockets, empty sockets. Uh, that can't be upgraded, right? So for our axe, we're going right. So that there gives us a poison dot debuff. That gives us five additional attack power. That gives us four. That gives us eighty one. Two seventy seven. So the fact the the juicy fire diamond one gives us two seventy seven. Is that one of them, one of these give me eighty something? Poison, magic, 81 there. Aye, uh, the four additional fire damage. I think I'm just going to go with the attribute scaling though because of just simply how strong it is. Uh, and there's just that doesn't matter to me, so it doesn't. We can upgrade ours. What do these do? Oh, it just tells you what it does. Okay. And then obviously we've got the griffin here. The griffin boots that just increases our physical. Yosh, there we go. Now we're. Oh, the Griffin's still weaker than the Living Legend armor. Lol. Right. Anyway, let's go see if we can get some level ups, and then we'll run the entire way back. Why do I feel like an idiot? <laughs> we spent so long doing that for no reason. Oh, hang on. Wait, there we got an attribute uh, thing, didn't we? Attribute. Spell point, which is statistically useless in our current uh, predicament. Um, for right, is endurance going to be worth it, or are we just going to stick to the strength? Start going agility, la. Uh, one for strength and one, yeah, that'll do there. And then as for spell points, I don't know what. Ah, oh, there we go. That there then increases it to... Ah, uh, then it just all starts requiring 12. So, yeah, no, that's that out of the question. Right, eh... Uh, let's... Right, so we ran into two of the bit, uh, more devious fellows in here, so we did. So let's go in and see if we can kill them now. Definitely a lot stronger now, so I'll, I'll at least I'll, I'll accept that. I'll accept. I'll definitely accept that we're stronger. That's that's going to be a given. I'll definitely accept that so far. Right. Now, where the fuck is this mage bitch at? Just creep up nice and slowly behind him, and then bam. Really? Did that just like glitch out or something? Or am I missing something? Dick. Ow! Dick. Two horn shield? I keep pressing pause. I do. I do apologize. Two horn shield. Three sockets too. Holy shit. 
61 boys? This thing gives me 60... I'm sorry, what? Like, that gives me 12, 12, 8, 4, 2. Why does that give me 61 poise? The fuck? Does that mean that I am now officially on fucking staggerable? Okay, we're back to where we started, so we are. Let's just proceed on, because this shield has me stumped now. I'm assuming that I am now impervious to stagger. At 61 poise, that is the highest poise rating anything has ever given me. So I am going to be under the assumption that I can't be staggered by shit all. And uh, this just screams boss fight. Why, hello? Oh, hello, spider bitch. Oh, wow. My damage is rather inferior. But yeah, uh, apparently I'm exceptionally difficult to stagger now, so I'm happy with this. Just keep wailing on her. We've got five health potions and enough poise to do me a lifetime. Apart from gigantic hits like that there. Kinda of disappointed though, my weapon's now not that far for right now. Is it bad that you look like a Tyranid though? Chug. You're just using the big metal antenna to start sniping me now, are you? Like seriously, the, the amount of poise this has given me is a little bit ridiculous, let's just be clear. What are you doing? Hi, what are you doing? No, you really, like, I'm sorry, but you really look like a Tyranid. Sure you do. I'm just kind of disappointed that my axe is now just not as strong as it should be. Either that or this bitch has just got loads of physical defense, but at the same time, though, like, I'm just face tanking this bitch like nothing ordinary. I haven't done anything particularly like to beef myself up by an extreme amount for just having a lot of heavy armor. I wouldn't exactly call this boss a skill related boss. Infiltrator, die. Crystal of the Traveler, okay. Is that my item you're standing next to? Traverse through the catacombs and look for... Okay. Oh, we got the unique pole arm. Okay. I'm assuming it's something that requires agility then. Which one is it? Oh, 
Oh, there it is there. Oh, no, it's strength. 76 damage. Let me see. Ah, yeah, it's one of these full arms, right? The fuck? How slow does it need to be? Yeah, no, pop, I'll happily pass on that. Thank you very much. Give me back my axe. That is horrendous. Right, talk. Eh, uh, I'll do it. That was Lots sense. of training. Lots of training. Yeah, easy peasy. What a the Vector goes wild, of course, stone tablets. Here you go, I got loads of them. Pleasure doing this so long. What would you give me in reply? Oh, a horn thing? Oh, wow. And a lot of resistance shards. That's not what I need. Right, we're gonna go back rather than forward. You're not gonna let me go backwards, are you? No, you're not. Unless I'm in the wrong direction, which is very possible. Right, so that way. That way it looks like a dead end. I want to go find that gate that I just op tactically opened by killing that boss. Is this it? Ah, this is it. And then this gate should be open, but we're going to go rest up super quick because... Um, I would like to um, do something. I don't know what yet, but we're going to do something. Ah, it's just basically reset. I mean, that's what I want to do. Right, and then we're going to crack open this. This is one down. This. There's an odd boss here, I believe, as well. We'll wait and find out, I guess. Right. You just gotta give me loads of chests? Yes? Okay, I can accept this. Open sesame. Okay. Open sesame. Empty bottle. Really? That was my prize. An empty bottle. Thank you. What's this? Codex. Oh, we got the Kodak sword. This is gnarly now, so it is. Right. So I'm going to show you this real quick after we get out of here. We've now unlocked the Kodak. Right. So the Kodak is, in the polite terms, right, three slots. Right. This is the Commander sword, remember? Yeah. Right. It's gnarly in terms of damage, guys. It is on a whole new level whenever it comes to damage. So we're going to use it. I'm going to just, I'm just going to demonstrate to you why this thing is as gnarly as it is. Once we get to a smithy, um, you want to talk to me or my? Oh. Give me a good reason why I shouldn't kill you. Give me a good reason why I shouldn't kill you right now. Me, you, okay. A reward. A reward. For oh, what? Go oh, on. Bring skulls. Bring Give me skulls. Well, heck, reward. What, need what for? Make potion Stop. Okay. I'll do it. See what I can find. I'll see what I can find. I think I already have a couple of skulls, weirdly enough. Because we've already been in the catacombs. So. I have some. Need more. Okay. Well, 2000 XP. Yeah, I'm not going to be fucking complaining anytime soon. Stance. Now what about unlocked? Right. Now I've got it. Now I've got a new shield. Stance. Which is apparently how. Which apparently has more poise. That makes no sense. It is a gold, however, which is block attacks to recover magic. But again, it's still, I see this, I, I really need to figure out how this poise system works. Because apparently this has more poise than this, yet this one says 61, this one here says 46. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it makes no sense. I don't think it's designed to make sense, to be fair. Right, um, there was a doorway back there, but there's a doorway here that I want to nosy through first. We're going to go say hi to whatever's here. Oh, it's not a tyrant. Where's your casket up? Where's your tyrant heart up? Dude, I really don't feel like murdering you right now until I've got that tyrant heart destroyed. So I'm just gonna run around you. Or more accurately, just jump away from you. Right, yeah, fuck off. I'm looking for a tyrant heart right now. And you're in my way. There it is there. Right. 
Right, mate, you're just pinning me in here. I can't see shit. And thanks to this game's wonky ass fucking camera, this is annoying. Heal up. Oh, there's good stagger on it though. Okay, game. You're now, now you're just doing my head in. Right. Another lever to pull. For fuck's sake. How many levers must I pull this day? Right, that one there is blocked off, obviously. There's nothing else here. No chests or anything. Right, let's run up here and see what's up here. As I said, I'm running painfully low on it. Well, I actually ran out of healing, so we're already in problematic terms here. The joys. Right, that's my exit, and there's somebody there waiting on me. Right, that is my exit. Let me see what's back here then. Right. Cool. Yes, I'll bring you more skulls later on. I says I would have brought you more in the first time, but I was kind of too weak to do anything about it. I'm sorry, okay? Now, where the fuck does this lead? Cool. Oh! The ancient cool. cave. Okay, right. Don't need to go there. We've already been there. Look, I'll bring you more human skulls later on. When I, uh, if I remember to bring you said human skulls. We did get the Traveler Stone, so I'm assuming there's a, a teleport way of doing things, oh. I'm assuming. Quick, Who are you? Here. You're the captain. What are you doing here? We saw this shining jewel while running from the Rogar, so we jumped in. Could there be anything Oh, for fuck's sake. We can't get back now. And the captain? He'll never forgive us. We're trapped. You escaped to you this escaped place? Rogar and came here. And how on earth could we know where it would take us? You can't you stay here. Leave. Well, we were on our way to the tower by the bridge, the one on the right. We thought we'd hide there, but there's a powerful demon Powerful demon garden. garden. Of course there is. <sighs> I'll, see I'll see what I can do. Oh. Right, I think, yeah, there should be a... For as horrible as this is going to sound, there is another boss. Oh, there is going to be soon to be another boss, I'm nearly sure of it anyway. Right, we're all in here find a nice little spot. The demon's down here. Unless there's demons on down on the bridge. Is this what oh, hello. No. You will it help you me find travel? me? No. Travel to different dimensions. But it will you, let me. you need craft. Oh, okay. Right, craft. Uh, let's get rid of these here. Let's power rune. Magic. Okay. Big runes. Higher luck. Okay. Equip runes. Now, codex, because it has three slots. No, right. I just equipped one rune, right? 90 damage, 122 damage. Do you see what I mean by how broken this can get out of hand? How quickly broken this can get out of hand? This is what I mean. This is how straight up busted shit can get out of hand. 137 straight away. That is now bullshit of a part. That's my point. Oh, hello. Alright, he, he can Maybe. now just teleport all over the show now. Oh, okay. That's actually saved me so much pain. Right, but again though, I'm still trying to figure out why can they not leave? I've cleared the way, haven't I? Oh, why is it Right, because I need more health potions, you know. Right, let's run down here and see if there's a demon guarding the way. If there is no demon guarding the way, then there's, then there's no issues. There is nothing guarding the way.
I'm stumped on what I'm meant to do for these guys. I'm not gonna lie. Get open, right? So I am able to freely run back and forth from area to area. Freely. Fuck it, we're going on without them. Keystone Crypt. Who's I? Is there an odd boss around here that I don't know about? Uh oh. Oh, right. You okay. Need some help. You need some help. <laughs> it is too late. What I guess this is here? a good place to say. What we happened? Escaped through the catacombs. We escaped through the catacombs. It's a pathway. I did not so, make yes, it. okay. We did not make it. Jump up into the pathway. Yes. Uh, Say it. Okay. Right. I stopped the Rutherford's pack. I killed all the lords. I stopped the Rogar. So there's still hope. You help. help. Maybe then he will stop. What? Go. Through the catacombs. Okay. Human tattoo. Wow. Is that a warden? I suppose he was called the first warden, so... It makes sense, I guess. Alright, let's go smack about this warden then. Round two, boy. Round two. Yes, do your little dance. We done? You have a stamina bar, sir. Quick and easy. Small rune, okay. That door is still sealed. And I can't go up that way. Okay, fuck that then. I still need to figure out how the fuck to get those guys back. I would kinda like the XP from their fucking quest, to be honest. But I have no idea what that's going to involve. So then, where are you going to go for? Sir, can you not? Thank you. So the next spot we're going to is Catacombs, which we've already attempted, but this time we are substantially more powerful. And oh wow, we've got a lot of XP. And can you guess where that's going? That's going straight into strength. Simply because my weapon steals off of strength. And I'm getting shit tons of power from it, so I'm gonna take it. Thank you very much. So yeah, I'm, I'm stumped on the other ways to Alright, right done that, that's where we got Pavel's ring, so it was. But yeah, in terms of everything else, we kinda just sort of stumped in terms of progression. That just looked sore. That there is blocked from the other side. Smack! Ah, oh, the power that I now wield. The Codex is definitely one of the beefier weapons in the game. It just it's because it's simply because it comes with three slots. Throw a couple of lock ru uh, lock runes in there that increases its attribute scaling and it becomes a absolute monstrosity of a weapon. As it says I'm pretty sure there's a long sword or a, another weapon that you could probably pull off the same thing with, but as it currently sits, this thing's just there's not really much that you can do to stop it. So there isn't, there really is not much you can do to stop it. So, hmm, I say we kill our way into the catacombs and then see what we're going to do from there. Hey, excuse me, sir, but you still seem to hit rather hard, mate. But I hit just as hard as you do now. Right, on the other hand though, I Haley would be nice because I'm taking damage from I don't know what. Boys! Has its uses. Just poise through everything guys. That's it. That's Lords of the Fallen 101. Poise through everything. Right, you need to die. Because you're annoying. Oh, 
fine, you can die too. And next. We've got two chunguses here. I still don't like the fact that I bounce off them though. I don't have the energy to do a follow up either. Why, why do you guys have to be so unnecessarily annoying to fight? Like, you are unnecessary, you understand that, yes. Like, I'm just waiting to the point where I'm gonna be able to just plow straight through your shades like it's a piece of cake. Like, I can in two hits. Or just straight to Sheen's side. Apparently that works too. Alright, so that there should be our access to the catacombs. I'm just like, taking a nosy around and see if there's anything else of interest floating about right now. I guess not. Really work. Into the catacombs? Uh, this is not the catacombs? Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, we're back to the catacombs now, so we are. So now we get now, now we get to look at that look at our brand new power. Now we are now we're now we're dangerous. Oh, hang on, maybe not. We're about to die. Okay, so you're stronger than expected. So that or I just did not have the ability to use my weapon properly. I don't know. Did that bother me a little bit? Right. Heal up. Progression. Get an all level up in. And uh, we're gonna go into endurance. <laughs> so we are because well more. So yeah, in terms of that Yeah, the codex really just rules the roost in terms of power. There's my other lesser luck room. Right. We need to find a smith as soon as possible. So we do. Right, all that there, everything else is more or less fully upgraded, I guess. Quest items, uh. New flesh, heart still beating. Okay, human tattoos are not a quest item, I'm just like, what the fuck? Like, like that's. That, 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 that is what I would classify as morbid game. So, yes, that will do us for now. So, well, um, we're going to go through on a rampage through the catacombs, which we should have done the first time we came to the catacombs, but we just simply weren't strong enough. Plus, there's a door that I remember that it was um, that we might be able to look at too. So, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. Please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't enjoyed. And, guys, I shall see you all in the next video. Bye.